everyone welcome back to the world of morgo i'm morgan and this is my channel where we focus on all things fashion beauty lifestyle and travel if you're new here welcome join the gang if you've been here for a while now thank you so much for coming back and tuning in and we're gonna get into some things today and by get into some things i mean we are talking my fall and winter boot collection um i'm not gonna this isn't like a style video i'm just gonna be going through um all of the boots that i have kind of talking about like how comfortable they are um and showing you all the styles that i have and then i'll probably insert in some pictures of how i've already styled the boots um so you can get an idea of how to style even though i won't be styling it right now um and then i'm gonna of course leave links below uh, some of these boots I've had for a while now and by a while, a while <laughs> I mean maybe like going on two, three years, um, but they're still really good boots. So if I can't find a link, I'll do my best to, uh, I'll do my best to link similar items. And yeah, let's get into it. Okay, y'all. So the first pair of boots we're going to get into are these cow print booties size 10 there's actually no link to this because about a year maybe like a year and a half ago i said that i was gonna open a boutique full of like accessories and shoes um but i never did that idea is kind of on the back burner for now um so i was just ordering a stock of like a bunch of different things to try and test out and wear and these boots were you know in that testing phase but i actually fell in love with them um they're super comfortable they you know they're black and white so they go with pretty much anything um that you have in your closet and yeah it's just it's a cute fun texture and you just slide it right on in i think that's the only like con of these boots is that they don't have a zipper you have to like slide your feet into which you know i'm not really a fan of but other than that they're pretty cute um, I will see if I can find the link to these from the supplier that I ordered them from so you guys could just like order like a sample pair of boots. I want to say these this sample was maybe like $50 or so that sounds about right don't quote me but I'll also try to find some other like cow printed boots um, that you can actually like shop directly from a store. So yeah let's go to the next one. Okay, next up we have these like black suede booties with like this like croc textured, you know, back sole and heel, which I absolutely love. Gives the girl a little drama. Again, there's no zipper for these, so you have to like slide your foot into, but they're pretty easy to slide my foot into. Um, these are size 10. These are from Windsor Store. Um, my senior year of college, I actually worked at Windsor store. So of course, employee discount, got all the goods. Um, and yeah, these are just a cute, regular, regular black booty to throw on with some jeans, you know, a sweater, put a coat on and you're out the door, quick and easy to wear to work. Obviously I have not been to work in forever um <laughs> so i've maybe worn these maybe like two or three times um since fall and winter you know have started well it's winter now in virginia it's currently snowing as i'm fil filming this video um but yeah uh i'm pretty sure these aren't gonna be like on the windsor website so i'll just link some of my favorite like black booties for you guys okay so next we have these leather biker boots i got these from um asos maybe like two years ago um still classic still look so brand new i don't wear these as much because i am a heels girl i will always wear the boots that are like thigh high boots you know what i'm saying um but these are good for when you don't feel like dressing up when you want to look a little bit more edgier um and yeah i love the chunky let me zoom in i love the chunky sole the design right here for some extra razzle dazzle um these are a little hard to get your foot into you literally have to like loosen up all the laces in order to slide your foot in but other than that um i love them they are heavy this thick sole they are heavy 
and they definitely like hurt when you first wear them like you have to wear them around to break them in but once they're broken in you're good to go so cute so chic black of course black goes with everything you know i'm going through this video and all the boots realizing that i have a lot of black boots i need to change that <laughs> but black is just so chic and so classic um okay next we have these black platform thigh high boots these are from miss lola official i will link these down below i actually got gifted these um this year back in towards the end of august and i do have a coat with miss lola i need to check to make sure that it's still active before you got shot but i wear these all the time again i am a thigh high girl bada boom bada bam love and when it comes to thigh high boots if they don't stay on your thighs just make sure to wear like thick socks and then also you can use like double-sided tape to like you know tape them to your legs so they stay in place or tape them to your leggings or whatever you have on with these you can take tape them to your legs so they don't move love super chic super these are i just love these okay <laughs> next up we have these peanut butter boots from asos i love these switching it up from the black um again like i said earlier like a lot of my boots are black so i wanted to switch it up and realize that i don't really have any like brown boots um tan boots or anything like that so i was like i saw these and i instantly fell in love with them i don't wear these as much and i really love them so i want to try to like wear these more um but again i'm so used to just wearing like black boots that you know sometimes i feel like i neglect these babies but they're so cute and so chic just ugh. a cute blazer moment a cute puffer moment a cute pea coat moment and yeah and these are a little these are a little heavy just due to the to the bottom because they're chunky um and then i also got a size 10 in them but once you break them in they're pretty comfortable to me just wear thick socks and i bought these this year so the link should still be there if not i will do my best to link something similar for you guys okay next up we have these like western thigh highs from public desire i got gifted these i want to say about like two years ago and i'm obsessed and i'm never getting rid of them they're like it's like off-white and black so again they go with a lot <laughs> of items that i have in my closet um off the bat these are pretty comfortable y'all i wear heels all the time so you know when it comes to comfort levels i can wear heels for hours um but these were pretty comfortable um just when it comes to like all thigh high boots or just any boots in general i always like to wear thicker socks because boots i feel like tend to be a little bit more heavier um you know depending upon like the sole the width and some some boots you gotta wear skinnier socks because the boot itself is so narrow that you gotta slide your foot in there but for the most part i do like to try to wear um thicker socks and these are just so cute these are probably one of my favorites i wore these in nashville i'm gonna I'm insert that clip for y'all um so y'all can see how i style them and yeah i believe these are a size 10 they should be a size 10 um when it comes to my sizing I'm usually a size 10 in like closed toed shoes so like sneakers boots I'd be a 10 but when it comes to like heels or sandals or flip flops I can tend to you know there's some wiggle room with me being able to wear like a size 9 9 and a half um, maybe sometimes even like an 8 and a half it just depends but yeah public desire public desire has so many cute boots definitely need to shop public desire if you're looking and shop public desire like if you're looking for something different you know so next up we have another pair of like biker kind of knee length boots these are from semi london i absolutely love these boots but i realize i don't wear them enough as i should 
um so i'm gonna leave them out so i can try to wear them more but i will say i've had these for about like going on two years now um and these are super relaxed um you know if you want to be a little bit more edgier because they have like all the lacing and the buckles um so again you can pair this with a, a cute blazer a cute all black moment um a puffer coat pea coat and i got these in a woman's size 10 as well i realize a lot of these boots i don't wear as much as i should but it's actually winter winter now in um, virginia so i'll definitely be in these more and these before we go to the next one these ones you also kind of have to break in a little bit we're almost through the boots we just have this pair and then one more pair and then we're done with the video so the pair i'm about to show you i've had these for about two years now actually i want to say i've had these for about three years now i'm never getting rid of them um as long as i can keep them like clean and you know nice and shape and everything but look at these blue turquoise croc thigh high boots I got these on sale from Pretty Little Thing, size 10, of course, and y'all, I wear these all the time. I love these boots. They're, they just make such a statement. Um, I get compliments on these whenever I wear them. Uh, people love these when I post them on Instagram and everything like that. Um, and yeah, but unfortunately, I know for a fact these are sold out because I just had to try to find um, a new link for these or linking something similar because someone um, saw me wear them on Instagram and asked about a link. And unfortunately, they are sold out. Um, yeah, the last time I checked, they were sold out. They might have restocked. Um, but again, these are three years old, so I highly doubt they're going to bring these back. So I'll do my best to link some turquoise croc boots for you guys. And hopefully we can find a dupe or, you know, something similar. So you guys can, you know, make a statement in these streets. All right. All right. And last but not least. I have these white and black booties from Sorel. Um, these were gifted to me back at the beginning of uh, December, I believe. Maybe like the end of November or beginning of December. One of those. Um, and I absolutely love these because I was literally just saying before they gifted me these that I need more like white booties. Um, so yeah, I'm super happy to have these in my collection. We have a thicker sole here and kind of like a platform situation going on here. And then I also love this like neon green strip in the back to add a little bit of, you know, razzle dazzle, okay? Um, I've worn these twice to kind of like break them in. I don't really, I took pictures in these, but I don't really, you can't see the shoe like that within the picture, but I'll still insert it in for you guys anyways. Um, since it's like actually winter now in Virginia, I definitely see myself, um, wearing these more. Once I broke them in, they were, um, super comfortable. The only thing I hate about like booties that are short like this, I feel like if you don't wear like longer socks, they'll like brush up against your skin, you know? So when it comes to like any, um, you know, booties or like boots that aren't like knee high or thigh high, you want to make sure you have a good sock on. So um you know the back of the shoes aren't like brushing up against your skin and like bruising your skin and all of that because no one wants that and that's very uncomfortable but yeah these are a size 10 these sh i believe um these should be on the site because i believe they are uh, a part of like their newer collection um so yeah if you like these i will link them down below that's the end of my fall and winter boot collection uh, i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys on my next video and if you're new here go and watch my nashville vlog 
uh, that just went live last week. And yeah, that's it.